So these are the trimmers that I bought from Amazon about a year ago. So I'm going to show you, they still work. They keep a great charge. This is how it comes in the box. Um, again, I've been using this, so this, yours should look a little better than this. It also comes with a manual, um, which I no longer have. But these things are awesome. And I can probably use it about three or four times before I have to recharge it. So right now, it's probably on about 50%. So as you can see, they're still holding up. They're, they're not peeling. And keep them greased up. Every few cuts, they have oil. They have a little brush that comes with it. Then they have the different guards. They got the 1 16th, the 1 8th, the 1 4th, and the 3 4th. And I usually mainly use the 1 16th and the 1 8th. So I am done. All right. It probably don't look too much different, but trust me there. You don't worry about that little hair missing at the bottom. It'll get fixed. All right. Once I mold it down. All right. But I put my little part in there, lined up the front. I call myself fading, but again, I just use the 1 16th and the 1 8th, usually when I cut my hair. If I do cut the top, I will use that three fourth or I use a one third guard with another set of clippers. All right. But remember, I was on 50% after about 15 minutes. Now I'm on 35%. All right. And it takes a USC, um, USB C charger. And that also comes with the clippers. But I just use my phone charger. So I'm rinsing everything out, cleaning it, letting it dry. Um, also, I did cut my hair down. I trimmed my ends all the way around my head. Yeah, I messed up right there. We ain't worried about that. We'll cover that up later. My business. So now I have washed and conditioned my hair. All right. So I use the Pixius foam. She is also, I'll come back to that in a minute. But these are the wraps that I use. I like the white ones better, the black ones ripped, and those little thin ones ripped. And you just need a little comb. But this Pixies hair foam, um, made by Brandy Lucas, she's out of Texas. This is probably, it is the best foam that I have used for my hair. Whether I'm wearing it natural and curly or straight, it has a stickiness to it. And what I mean by that is, it's not sticky to the touch, but when you put it on your hair, Let's say you haven't put a relaxer in it. Some of y'all may call it a perm, but it's a relaxer. But once you put that in there or not, you know how your hair don't stay down? Well, nope, not with this foam. It sticks right in place. That way you got to worry about it coming up. And since my hair is very wavy naturally, I do have to worry about that. So right now I'm just molding it. And this part, getting all those little wrinkles and things out, matters. So that way when it dries, you don't have that hump anywhere in your head. And the reason I'm doing all this is just in case I don't want to put heat on it, all I got to do is put some oil on it and go. All right, I'm just smoothing everything down right now. I know it looks like a lot of foam, but trust, it's, it's fine. It's better to have more than not enough. And I use the brush to literally lay everything back down even better. That's what my brush does. It gets all those extra wrinkles and waves out. All right. You get your little access foam. Not really necessary because the strips are soak it up. But I use about five for me. And the reason why is because I don't really sit under the dryer. I'm about to go to bed. But if I was not going to bed, I would literally probably use one or two strips. All right. That way, as soon as you wrap your hair with these, make sure you get everything at the bottom and the back. That's what helps your hair lay down. All right. But two, about one or two strips, you sit under the hair dryer. That way it gets crispy for about 15 to 20 minutes. My hair is thick, so about 20 minutes for me. But again, I'm using five because I am not about to get in the dryer. I'm going to bed. 
yeah, I'm just going to put it in my mouth because I'm about to cut these off anyway. And I'm making sure I get everything covered. So, again, it takes me about five strips to cover my whole entire head. You could probably get this done with four. My head's kind of big. Anyways, so we're going to cut all these off. Don't need it. Then usually I'll take a wrap and I'll wrap this in addition to the strips around my head. All right. And then when you're under the dryer, you can take it off after 10 minutes. That way the air can keep going through. But like I said, I'm going to bed. So I'm about to wrap this up. And my hair will be dry when I wake up. And my hair seems softer when I let it air dry. And it comes out just as good. Thank you, JJ. You're welcome. <laughs>